Hey, good afternoon. Guess what? You're a small human inside this didactic box here. I'm about 10 foot and this box easily 9 feet. This is the only Saturn S and the Mercury X washing and shearing station. We're about to unbox this bad boy. I do have a sick knife that says do not put in the dishwasher. It comes with a really awesome knife sharpener in there. And it's a pretty damn sharp knife. It's going to open this box very easily. Okay, so let's just hope I don't cut myself. Because, you know, we don't want to see a lot of blood on this video yet. Okay, here. So again, this is a 3D printing machine. A lot of people that don't know. That's what this big box is all about. I am planning on making a few more videos. So stay tuned to that. Uh, we're going to make videos on the printing that we make. This is a resin printer, by the way. We did a lot of research on these things because they're not super cheap. Um, we ended up ordering it directly to the company because it was just a little bit cheaper. We saved a little bit of money doing it that way. And so, why not? Let's just hope I don't drop anything while I'm opening this thing up here. Cause that would suck and I guess it would be kind of funny. There will be some editing cause the cutting is sucking right now. Definitely need a better knife for next time. And then this needs to be upside down. So, let's see what we got. Ah, the bubble stuff. Alright guys, we got two boxes. The wash and cure machine, Mercury X bundle. You definitely need that if you buy this thing here for sure. So this is the upside down Ogu Saturn S 3D printer. All we got. The reason why we got the resin printer is that the other printers are more of a plasticky type of a printer and it leaves a lot of like little lines on your 3D printing. So anything that you print, whether it's small or tiny or big, it's gonna have a lot of tiny little lines that are gonna be noticeable. And that isn't cool. Um, we don't want that. We wanna have it look nice and crisp and you know smooth. All right guys, let's get this unboxing. We're gonna start out with the 3D printer first. All right, just to uh, me not cut it myself. Jeez. Look at what? It looks like it's packed really nicely. Got these little corner things on here. Um, whoa. Not wood, but really thick. Awesome packaging. It's always a plus, because you know, you wanna make sure that your stuff isn't gonna get damaged. So this is a tool kit. I'm not going to mess with any of this yet. <clears throat> I just want to show you guys how it comes. That way you guys get an idea. So it comes with an adapter stuff. It comes with like little clippers. It looks like an AC adapter. Little spatula so you can remove the thing from, uh, from your machine. And all the screws and stuff that you need. Oh yeah, this is like a filter. So this bigger version comes with a filter. This is the little USB drive so that you can download all the stuff that you're going to print so this little drive and you're gonna pop it in the machine and it's gonna print out there's a lot of learning to do guys so we're gonna be there soon comes with little spatulas all the stuff that you need so you can connect the machine very cool all this, all this little stuff here i believe was extra because the other machine doesn't have any of that it comes with a little protection gloves it comes with a little mask man this thing is beautiful oh so I saw that other people that have channels and stuff that order this directly to them were able to kind of get their name of their channel here. I don't even know how that happened because when we ordered it, I don't even believe they gave us an, an option to do that. That would have been kind of cool, but I don't think we got an option for that. Was there an option for that? No option for that, confirmed. All right, this thing's a little heavy. Gentle is it, man. Alright, nothing here. I hope you guys let me know because I'm just gonna toss this on the ground. Nope, nothing there. Alright. 
Hey guys. Ding. I'm excited. You guys don't even know. This is so cool. I plan on making, if I actually match with me, my brother and I, we are going to make all kinds of cool little things with this thing here. Little weapons, accessories, or figures. There's a lot of different things you can make here. A lot of cool things. I'm sure they're here. If you're watching this, you already know what you can make with this. Otherwise, you wouldn't even be here. So, there's a lot of cool things to make. And we are going to make them. And we are going to put videos on this stuff. Package very well. I'll tell you that. Look, you can save this. Put it over your soup, <laughs> your fruit. I don't know. Just messing around. I'm gonna pull this top part here. Oh, dang! How shiny that is. Cool cover, right? There we go. We move this little tape right here. So, <clears throat> one of the things that I know a lot of people have had little gripes about this is that the power switch in the back, I mean, no biggie, you know, beats around it, you know, whatever. But I do know that's a little gripe that people have had. It's heavy. Are you guys ready? <laughs> I have a thing about this. Just a little thing. So this is the build plate. This is basically, we're gonna set this up up here. It's going to drop down. We're gonna put the liquid stuff in here. All the liquid stuff that we I'll show you another video on that later because we bought a lot of stuff. So we put the liquid resin here. This thing will heat up. It'll do its thing. This thing will drop all the way down. And it takes a long time for whatever you built to, to be made. A lot of hours, I know that. But as it's slowly building, it's going to be going up and up and up and up. And all your stuff is going to be right here, kind of coming down. We're going to unbox the Mercury X washing and curing machine next. Sharp knife. Little box. I'm just gonna get open. So, very strong box. Super strong box. It doesn't feel flimsy at all. Good material again from the packing. Again, this pack is very well, guys. Very, very, very well. Oops. What happened? Fancy looking. All right, so this is for the washing. For the washing, this is for the carrying. A lot of little pieces in here. Screws, Allen wrench. Power cable, power source. All right, and we have a lot more stuff in here still, guys. Let's keep unboxing. Oh, there goes another one of those. Things. Okay, I know exactly what this is here. So this is the little UV post that are gonna help to dry out your items. There's two of them. Maybe there's another piece, but that's what this is right here. So you're gonna stick them in the machine. It's gonna turn, and these will help to dry out and cure your items that you are printing. Very cool, man. This is, I'm telling you, man, you guys should go online, take a look. Um, if you guys are looking for a 3D printer, and this looks super awesome. I, I, I can't wait to put this thing to work. So this should be the base. 
Yeah. All right, so this is the base for this part right here. Again, two different pieces. This is going to wash your resin cleansing that you make. Big bucket, you see that? So if you got a big piece that you're making, man, this is gonna be badass. Um, I think I saw some people that were making super uh, bigger items too, that they would kind of cure half of it or wash half of it, and then they'd flip it around and kind of continue with the rest. So if this isn't a big enough bucket for what you're doing, I've seen people do that. So this thing right here is magnetic. You're gonna put the base on top of it. That's gonna spin due to the magnets in here. How pretty that is. I don't know if I got a good angle on that, but I'm pretty sure I do. But man, that's nice looking, dude. Look at that. Look at that. It's shiny. I mean, this whole thing is gonna look nice. No matter where you put it, it's gonna look nice. That's for sure. And so this piece here is the curing system. You'll put, there you go. So you put these things in here, boom, boom. It comes with two of them for easier and faster drying, I believe. And then this is the top. This is super lightweight, by the way. This piece right here is incredibly light. But I guess this is just gonna be a little turntable, basically. And it's gonna have the lights that are gonna cure your 3D printing. All right, guys, so again, look how cool these items look. Man, they look, they look pretty dope, right? They look really cool. We're gonna be making a lot more videos like this, guys. We got a lot of other products that we purchased so that we can do our printing. We got some airbrushes, we got paints, colors, the works. I don't know, that's all gonna be here. Keep an eye out. If this is the kind of stuff that you guys do like, give us a like. We're gonna be making a lot more videos like this. We bought a lot of items for this machine to put to use. Follow us, subscribe. If you guys have any questions, please, at the bottom right there. We have a lot of knowledge and we can always share it with you guys. So, don't be shy, talking to you. But again, this is the Elgu Saturn S, the Mercury X washing and curing machine. This is a 3D printer and it looks cool. <laughs> Look how cool it looks though. But um, give that thumbs up guys. Follow us, we'll be making more for you guys. We got a lot of stuff, so stay tuned.